It was a perfect day for baseball and close to 10,000 fans took advantage of it, pouring into the DBAP for today's ACC championship game between NC State and Florida State. 1992 was the last time the Wolfpack won the ACC baseball title. Could they do it today? Todd Gibson has the story. Wolfpack fans stream in Durham Bulls Athletic Park, hoping to get a glimpse of the school's first ACC baseball title in 23 years. Johnny Piedmont gets the start for the pack, pitches well in the beginning, but he'll run into trouble in the third. With one swing of the bat, John Sansone stakes the Seminoles to a 3-0 lead. Sansone crushes a three-run homer to deep left. But the pack responds with two runs in the top of the fourth. Bubby Riley slides home safely on the wild pitch. We've got a tight one, 3-2 FSU. The pack had its fair share of chances. State blisters the ball on occasions, including several shots with runners in scoring position. The pack hitting them at them all day long. Early in the game, we had a couple opportunities and didn't take advantage of it, but at the same time, it's that's baseball. Meanwhile, the Seminoles did take advantage of their opportunities, getting a couple of clutch run scoring singles in the fourth and seventh inning to stretch the lead to 6-2, and that would be the final. Florida State celebrates an ACC championship, denying the Pack their first title in 23 years. Still, the way NC State played down the stretch gives the Pack hope heading into the NCAA tournament. When we play with confidence, we can, we can compete with anybody in the country. If we can take a couple lessons from this week, and a couple lessons from this year as we've gotten better. We'll get a little better. Hopefully we're celebrating the championship next Sunday. The pack season is still alive. On Monday, they'll find out where they will play next week's NCAA tournament. In Durham, Todd Gibson, WNCN Sports.